The aim of the project is to improve physical therapy um, education by using augmented reality as an interactive medium between the instructor and the student. We call it augmented because by projecting images and models and 3D models onto it, you can literally change the way how things look. By projecting an animated anatomy model directly onto the patient body, it's a give the instructor the capability to demonstrate his experience, his knowledge and his clinical reasoning for the benefit of the students. For the student, the system acts as an interactive notebook where they can actually capture and annotate their recording during the demonstration in the class so that they can actually have to use that afterward. Physiotherapy is currently taught using lectures, tutorials, demonstrations, hands-on work by students. As well, we have independent self-learning. And we've identified that the early stages of our program is one where students need extra assistance. Students do understand in two dimensions how uh, muscles and joints work, but they struggle with uh, three-dimensional analysis. The beauty of this technology is we can um, set it up so that we can see the muscles and the joints moving in three dimensions. Physiotherapists in Australia are first contact and they work with people who can be very sick in hospital, really from intensive care, all the way through to people who've literally come off with a sore back. Because our students are first contact, it means that when they graduate, they have to be ready for practice. In that first year, we're preparing the students to go into the clinics where they're supervised. There's a big demand on what they need to know at that point in time. There is a real challenge for the students to capture, annotate and record a lot of information during class and they have to achieve mastery of demonstrated skill through a lot of practice in between class. We're really excited about its potential. We see it has huge opportunity to accelerate our students' learning. I think their ability to see the body in action in a more 3D way and it combines learnings from separate areas into the same sort of lesson, which would be fantastic. It'll allow them to integrate their learning. The Microsoft Research Centre for Social New has been terrific. Uh, I've really enjoyed working with them. They've been exceptionally good. The Microsoft Research Centre for Social New is a collaboration between the University of Melbourne and Microsoft Research, with support from the Victorian State Government. The centre is exploring the role of emerging technologies such as voice, touch and gesture in, um, in complex social environments. This project is really important. It's dealing with a, an important educational problem of clinical reasoning, how we teach students about how they make sense of the human body in a clinical context. And this is a very difficult thing to teach. It's not just the, the intimate experience of an individual student with their tablet, we're using a large space for almost like a performance, but that performance is used to illustrate a very important educational context. What you see in the scenarios are skeletons and muscles model projected onto the student. So that the model actually moves accordingly to the movement of the students and that allows David, the instructor, to explain the concept better without having to refer to a skeleton mannequin. The system is made of multiple projectors and multiple Microsoft Kinect sensors. We built our software using Unity 3D Game Engine and Room Alive Toolkit and we combined the projection mapping and the Kinect body tracking information to project a 3D anatomy model directly on the moving person. One of the benefits of this technology is we can actually annotate position of the joint and we can annotate the attachments of the muscles uh, onto the skeleton. I think it uses pen technology in a really interesting way and one in a way that we haven't seen before where students can use their pen based tablets to annotate a real time augmented video recording and keep that for their own records. I think there's opportunities to see the lecture theatre as a broad space for, for technological innovation. I think that's a really exciting thing. Technology helping us solve our teaching dilemmas and our challenges is just fantastic. It's the future, it's exciting. <laughs>